What is up guys? My name is Ghost Utah and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. Now last time we played this, we stopped right here at the hyena lair. And we're going to find this hyena. She's actually one of the main mission's targets. My god. That's a lot of hyenas. I mean there's 3, but there's one. Yeah. All right. Sinu's just gonna help us. We're gonna find. I, I guess that's all of them. All right. Let's jump in here. Headshot. Yep. Another headshot. All right. Oh God, Marty. I hate fighting hyenas. One swap, two kills! Yeah! That's a lot lot of soft soft leather. And another headshot. That's three headshots, kids. That's a lot of soft leather. Really. Alright, now we're gonna go up here and kill this king hyena or whatever. This is the hyena's lair. No sign of Khalisek, though. Mered was telling the truth. Alright. I want to try to see if I can get Hagar. I can't. Okay. 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 Okay, that's a lot of hyenas on me. There's like four of them. Okay. Okay. Okay, run. We're running. Leave me alone. We're running. Well, that king's already dead. What? Aw, oh, come back here, you sissies! You want somebody? You're dead. Now, come on, you two. Or are you just gonna stand there? You you guys just give me a free one, sh one shot, so thanks for that. Where's this guy at? I he there's a guy here around here somewhere. Hang on. There's another chicken. Alright, buddy, I'm coming. Hang on, I gotta kill this guy. I gotta kill this hyena. God almighty, these guys are chickens. I swear this sickle sword is amazing. I've upgraded so much. Like Two to three hits, bleeding damage. Like, they're all they're all dead. Like two or three swings. Oh God! I didn't even see him in here. See? You see how it just his life just gained away? Kufu's tomb. She has detailed every crevice. Ah, she has not finished. That is where I will find her. I will head to the pyramid. A drawing of the Great Pyramid of Khufu? Most likely made of... I can't say that name. She seems to have drawn an attention to something beneath the tomb. I'm sorry, I couldn't say that name at all. I can say Khufu. Okay. Khufu? You're free, friend! I wonder if there's anything back here. Maybe some secrets. Absolutely nothing. But a neat campfire spot, though. Okay, I try to go down there, but he wouldn't go down there. Alright, she's at the Great Pyramids. In one of them. She's in one of the Great Pyramids. Vultures. Alright. Oh! Snap! Took 207. Oh! He coming in for the swoop and kill. But I quick shot him. Okay, we're gonna make our way down. Go to the pyramids. Oh! 
Oh! Now my ankle's broke. Come on, horse. I need to make a name for him. Right now my ankle's broken, so I need him to carry me. Whoa. Whoa. My god. I said this in the video a lot. The last video, a lot. That this game is gorgeous. Look at this. There's a hyena right there. Oh! That hyena didn't have a chance! Come on, hit him. Hit him. There we go! Get out of here. Man, he ain't even putting up. See? They're... Oh, see? Two sw All I had to do was two swaps on the... On it. That's what happens to most people. I thought, oh, go here comes bandits. Come on, guys. I'm just trying to kill your queen. Or whatever. I don't know if they're fish affiliated with her, but who cares? I want to kill him. Oh, what? I totally missed him. I'm on fire! I'm on fire! Okay, I pressed the adrenaline button so I wouldn't die on, by fire. Because that has happened a lot. Get out of here! That looked like something out of 300. Just took him off his horse. Alright. We're going to the Great Pyramid of Giza. And we're going. I, mean, I, I especially like this part of the game. I haven't explored much near like desert terrains but the Giza a region I like because I don't know these pyramids these pyramids actually look like the real life thing my god at least that must be inside that is a. I have fought like over like probably twelve hyenas in seven minutes, basically. Three guys and probably like twelve hyenas in seven minutes. That's what I'm gonna call this video, hyenas. That's all I'm fighting. He just dropped dead. He's like, this guy's too good. Oh my God! Quit. See that? They were both, one was in front of me and one was behind me. Just chomping away at me. I'm so impatient when I'm fighting hyenas. Because I want to not kill them dead, but then, like, they back up. And me, I'm just swapping. My god. Now, that's a lot of soft leather. Probably got, like, 35 leather. Why did I call my horse? I meant to. Ooh! A cave! Who dares to enter here? What silence has befallen her? A magi who has treaded many dunes to find you. Hide if you must, Hyena. But this tomb will not protect you. I demand that you stop here. Turn back now and I will excuse this intrusion. Siwa was an intrusion. So, I don't really know the full story of this game, not yet, but all I know is Bayek is on a freaking rampage. Foolish man, I am Iset, possessor of magic. The gods live here, not you. What sort of mischief is she entertaining? I am a god. Not really. I'm just the protector of Egypt. That's what a magi is, apparently. But yeah, I really don't know the whole story. All I know is, like, spoilers if you haven't played it yet. Well, yeah, I'm just going to say. But, like, there was this flashback before I got to explore the whole entire world of the game. Where these guys... Where these guys in masks... This trap door. Kidnapped, kidnapped his. 
will drench these arid plains with your blood. What is this place? A tomb beneath a tomb. These guys in masks Did took his son and killed him. And now he's on a freaking rampage. Whoa. Here. A dark place with a window to the gods. Why is it all glowy? Retransmission. Segment three. What the heck? Acquiring contemporaneity. It has been ninety five. Well, I didn't know it was gonna do that. Alisa drew these symbols here. Was she trying to figure out their meaning? Whoa. Still warm. And the ceremonial knife. Look at that. There's like a sacrifice. holograms. The walls told us of your coming when we once were. Look at them. Are they not? I'm looking at them. I mean, they're calling all, but I'm kind of freaked out. Walk the nick up. Ah. Tell of a tragic story. A story we transcribed on our structures, on our artifacts. A story we cannot alter. There's a dead guy. A mystery defying the simplest sight. On the table. Sacrifice. Oh, that guy was sacrificed. Never mind. Our scholars and scientists, poets and physicists. The sarcophagus is decorated with goddesses of the mother. The sarcophagus. Strange symbols are marked all over it. They all tried so hard to bring about change. Okay, okay, shut up. They, we I can't turn it off. I shouldn't even have pressed that. None I didn't know what I was going to do. The stories written into the walls of these rooms. By whom? Ooh. Oh. So I wonder if that's like a hint that. W Offerings to Osiris. Protector of the dead. I wonder if that's a hint for Eden's I apple. What these Haliset was after here. Haliset was doing a ritual. She began by calling to Osiris with these offerings. She used the knife to sacrifice. You know, Osiris of Egyptian she god. She blood for some dark purpose. She was attempting to learn these strange symbols. She must have found them in this room. Once she knew the symbols, she carved them here, and ended the ritual with one final prayer over the sarcophagus. Sarcophagus. Alice must be trying to bring someone back to life. But just who is buried down here? Hmm, who? Let's investigate, Shaggy. Child. Whoa. She sacrificed a child. She sacrificed a baby child. My child! Oh, her child. You My God, child. she looks creepy. Her rest is temporary. You have intervened on her reawakening. And yet you aligned yourself to the order. <laughs> that is this tomb. Harrison! Don't you dare say my name! My name does not merit your lips, you who have dishonored her. I am a good mother. Oh! Those reflexes, though. Man, he is dodging everything. What, dude? That is so fake. Dude, that's messed up. She sacrificed her own baby child. Unless she was dead, and then... <clears throat> Unless she was dead... <coughs> Sorry. Unless she was dead, and then... She tried to get her back from the dead. But... That's even more... I mean, that's sad and all, but... It's kind of messed up. I mean, yeah, sure, it's your daughter and all, but that's messed up. You are no different than any of the others who have come before you. Oh God! Quit firing arrows at me, lady! Oh, I can't see a thing. Hey! How am I supposed to get over there? Well, I guess I'll wait. So, yeah, I wonder what we just saw was like a hint further into like the origin of the Apple of Eden. Now! 
Now I will show you what happens to those who desecrate my daughter's tomb. Again with those reflexes. Okay. Fireball! Oh, I hit her. My God, she's got low health. That one fireball almost killed her. Oh, she almost got me with the. Oh! Oh, that was a head. Begun! Fight! She's dead. Oh my god. Keisha, Keisha, she's dead. I don't even know that's how it goes. <laughs> the afterworld. Do I walk among the dead now? A just end. You defiled the dead and enabled the people who killed my son. All on a selfish whim. No. I gathered the silica for them. It powered the magic stone of those who came before. You saw it, didn't you? These symbols only needed to be learned. It is not meant for us. It makes no difference now. I wanted to protect my daughter in life and death. I have done neither. Osiris, please grant me reunion. Uh oh. She walks alone in the field of uh oh. Her tamed babies are going to kill her. Oh, this is sad. Oh god. Oh, that's oh, that's just sad. I do love that suit though. Look at that. And now there's another blood stain on the feather. I think that's how. Altair had his, wasn't it? Like he had a feather of some sort and he'd like what like May you find your daughter in the afterlife, Halice. May the Lord of the Duat guide you. Like he had a feather and he would like like rub it on the wound of the blade. I think that's how that went. But yeah, maybe I hope I mean, <clears throat> it probably will happen. They'll show the apple. Of my God, I fell from a freaking. I mean, they probably will show the apple of Eden, but it'll probably be like towards the end where I gotta fight the like the main main target or whatever. I mean, I'll, I'll only kill four four targets as of her. I'm gonna go back and see what this thing said. This weird thing move up. Ooh, treasure. Exit tomb. What's this thing? Little, little lot of a little orb blot or something. What is that? Is it to power something up? Do I have to give that. I don't know, but Let's see if there's more. Yeah, there's one more. There's another one, and another one. What do these orbs do? I mean, they gotta be a key of something, unless they're just... I mean, I can't tell what that symbol is at the... Under the, uh... My rank and stuff, I can't... I, I can't tell what that is. <coughs> Do I have to give it to that? Retransmission, segment three. Acquiring contemporaneity. 
It has been 95 days since the great catastrophe. The messenger speaks. You must be wondering why I have reached out to you. It was written, you see, that you would come to this particular chamber. I mean, I don't know what none of that is. I'll let you see is holographics. <coughs> Look at them. Are they not fascinating? The walking equip inauditable. These walls tell of a tragic story. A story we transcribed on our structures, on our artifacts. A story we cannot alter. A mystery defying this in plain sight. We tried. Our scholars and scientists, poets and physicists, bright minds, rebellious hearts. They all tried so hard to bring about change. They, we all failed. None could change what we discovered, the stories written into the walls of these rooms. By whom, we never knew. We know they tell of the future that is, the future that was, and the future that is yet to come. The ghost of the Christmas. The Christmas ghost. The ghost. The inaudible. We failed at modifying the line. We failed at adding a single dot. It was clear. We were to be messengers at best. But messengers to whom? <laughs> to you. We removed our ability to read those stories from your original temple. A doorway that is also a puzzle. We must find a solution. Those were Brutus's words when he visited the vault under the Colosseum more than 2,000 years ago. He drew the vault, sketched it to the best of his abilities, but he could not see. Just as you were blind, you may read your watch, you may read hourglasses and calendars, but you cannot grasp beyond that simplistic surface. For now, the true reading of time still escapes you. And so today, the curtains pulled and the earth is shown, tragic and complete. Those walls you might never read. Events yet unfold as written. But something, anything, must change. You do not understand. Oh my saying. god. There's the orbs again. Oh, it's dark. I don't I don't know what that just said. So am I like a prophecy or something? Cause it did say we were waiting for you. Or something like that. I don't know. But. Those lots are like. Eden. Apple of Eden. Ish. Top. Glow. Whatever. Oh, I wonder if we power this up. With the tombs. Just took me outside. Back outside. Well. Ooh, there's a secret tablet in here. <laughs> oh, it's probably in the pyramid. I don't know why I went up there. I think it is. The crocodile. I might kill him next. Gotta get revenge on my boy. My baby boy. Let's see if we can just find another mission. Rise of Anubis.
But what if we could travel there? I mean, some of these regions you can't travel in them. Like, you have to be that range of level. You have to be in that level range to travel in there because if you go there and you're not in the range of that level, there's going to be a lot of people with red skulls on them. And they're like more powerful than you and that happened to me with a bunch of lions <laughs> I didn't know where I was going it was my first time actually exploring this game a freaking sandstorm hit me a sandstorm hit me and I didn't know where I was going I was just going in a straight line is there anything back here it seems like a long hallway oh there is do I just slide under it? Oh, I gotta press crouch. Slowly we walk. Oh, there's something blue. There is a commoner named Dead Judd Row. Who lit? I can't say those names. A commoner 110 years old. We eat 500 tons of bread, soldier of beef, a shoulder of, shoulder of beef for a meal and drinks hundreds of jars of beer. Another orb, a lot orb. What are those orbs for? I don't get it. If we can sell them, we'll probably get a ton of money. Holy cow! Ooh, I'm a rich. I'm rich. Yep, if I was in that situation. If I was in that situation, I'd grab everything I can. The unwarily who unleash the desert sand will be swallowed into the air depths. Hey, the door. I'm gonna hit the... I just love that sound. Listen to it. It's like you're actually walking on glass. Like, listen, it's got that... Where do I go? Oh, I go up here. A bunch of treasures. Oh, King, you are the great star companion of Oran, who transverses the sky, Oran, who navigates duels, Oruses, ascend from the east. Well, oh. I accidentally pressed that. Another orb. I wonder what these things are. Are they for that? That thing right there? Huh. I got a sword. Which is good, I guess. It's purple. A carbon crystal. Hey, I actually needed one of those. Ooh, a tomb. Ancient writing from the old kingdom. Into the writing from the old kingdom. Tomb a Khufu. Sweet. Well, guys, that does it for me on another video of Assassin's Creed Origins. Um, I want to play more of this. Maybe we'll do the crocodile. We'll kill the croc guy. Rock a dial in the next video. Hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video.